So I just used some vegan uh, almond milk and then I added cayenne pepper and paprika and a little bit of smoked paprika too. This one is extra, extra special because, well, you can <clears throat> quite see now, but it's filled with walnuts, which is my favorite. Now let's add some, a little bit, not too much of vegan cheese. Just to give it some body. Black pepper here. Using the same <laughs> fork that I used to cook because we don't have time for all that at Studio 7. We don't have um, people that are paid less than what they are worth working for us. I proud of it. So there goes the green onions. Okay, I've let that one fall, which was absurd. But. We've got three heads of basil. It's gonna be marvelous. I feel like I will spread like this. But actually, I regret that. I'm gonna leave them like this, like a flower. I'm a very um, traditional. You know the sand, I just olive oil it. Yum! Who's ready? Who's ready? I am. So there is order in chaos. Kind of. This position is horrible for my gut. Mm. It's only Thursday, and that's sad, but I wish I had wine now. I am in love with this. As you can see, my plate's already almost gone. It's been five minutes. Because when I eat at home, it means I don't have time for a full lunch break. I just ate it so fast that I couldn't even add on. But I probably would have put some more soya sauce, which I haven't put any at all. I love the way the greens were placed because you have different tastes you kind of select the taste just the green leaves on taste the basil is divine it's the first time is it the first time i ate my basil no but in a full place where it's like the main star it is and i'm so happy because i love basil i'm always trying to grow rosemary but my rosemary always dies but like this like mm, a big spoon of basil mm, then it's one taste Oh, I got two, two green peppers. It's gonna be a lot. Now the last most of the green. I don't know. Um, um, friends from Asia, please correct me. But and I'm sorry for using the term Asian. I just I'm not exactly sure where wasabi is from. Is it from Japan? Because we, we have them in Japanese restaurants, but we never know. And I think most greens they used for to make wasabi sauce. Is that right? Here. I don't know if it's because ours grew together, but they taste a bit like beetroot leaves and spinach. And at the end, you have that stronger sauce of uh, taste of a herb. This is divine. <laughs> I'm so sad. It's ending. Do you know when a meal is so good? That's like Halloween on Christmas. And in the night, you wish this never ends. <laughs> now I regret not having anything to drink with it. Do you not have nothing ready ever? This is the channel for you. I think I'll make some strawberry milk shake. <laughs> there you have it. I blame it on the mint. It was just here waiting for me. But we do have those strawberries. Ours are still growing. I usually would, would would use lime, but we do have those tangerines that are way, way, way past their prime. So I just make it work. And I will use some mint, but I don't know, the strawberries are kind of wanted vanilla, so it tastes like a milkshake, but this is already stepping into a smoothie aisle, so I don't know. They are just, you know, pull here, and I've changed my mind. I will do mostly tangerines, so I use three tangerines, these are the two. And I'll just add like three of the most mature strawberries, like 
this guy, this guy, and oh, we got a fat one. Good. This guy. I think I'm gonna use some cloves. So just put one, just for the taste, because the star is the mint thing. And I don't have a place to keep it, so I just use some of John's old bottles, which is good because there is some alcohol there, so it's gonna be disinfected. <laughs> Now let's go for the part. Best thing about owning your herbs <laughs> is that they are clean. They have like no pesticides. This one I will use to decorate at the top because when I make my own drinks I can afford it. an elixir i topped with some apple cider vinegar just to some something um a preservative <laughs> now i'm gonna add some sparkling water and see how that goes because i don't think i'm gonna add sparkling water to this it looks so good you know if you could not look like i'm <laughs> doing this in my work table i mean i'm better and not perfect leave these here to pretend that uh this is the bottle i'm getting it from but i'm actually getting it from the yes queen i actually wanted to show please don't splash on me thank you i feel like i've been uh, watching this uh, martha and snoop show and now i want to make <laughs> spirits and drinks not bad huh i wanted to show the progress that we made uh, we by we means me and my gods at the cleanup because I'm totally proud I never thought I would be able to do so much progress in a day that thing has been sitting for a while um, a whole year actually but I did make progress so let's go there <laughs> everything's a mess behind me why am I just want my beautiful when am I gonna have like a beautiful balcony as a view for you guys, huh? Mm -hmm. Very, very tropical. It's different. I forgot the honey. That's why. Oh well, different it is. Back at the place of the killing with my big old pimple. Second glass. Cheers. Mm. Why do I not make more juices? Now with this chocolate mint, I will. <laughs> All right, that lovely pseudo drink at the back. Can I show my second invention that I'm so proud of? This is my repair bin, right? It's from Target. Looked cute. Things just got shoved in there and forgotten about. Also, Tarantino is having a few days this summer with my feet. So, Quentin, and you watching this, call me. Thank you. Just kidding. I'm happily married. But my invention now, it's a roll things. And I store them like that. See, there is more space here. Like that, I can see everything that needs repair. And then I make better choices, huh? How good is that? Also, let's give a round of applause to this, because the way it was, I managed to kill that box. Don't show up there, because it's this. I'm sorry for the pillows, I know they look horrible. Uh, but they're already, like, all divided. That's, like, office. A couple of seasonal projects. This is everything that I'm going to use for parts. Fabrics. Uh, piping tapes this is for thank you cards and other packaging things also i'm sorry for how dirty the carpet is it's we have cats and no this is not organized i still don't know what to do with this thing but better right oh yeah and some home projects right there <laughs> 